Hi everyone, Lewis here, and welcome to a new episode of Autism Talk. There's a side of me I want to talk about. As you all know, I'm autistic. My case is mild, also known as Asperger's Syndrome. Today, I'll be talking about dating, friendships, and rejection. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel. Especially those with disabilities similar to mine. Being rejected or turned down is something that happens to everyone, not just those on the spectrum. This video was inspired by my own experiences, such as my great friend Kiari Chan, who I'd like to give a great shout out to, and I'll be sure to post her information, including her channel and Mersona, in the description below. N not to mention as well as being turned down throughout the years to even episodes of shows like The Good Doctor and Atypical. One time two years ago, I tried to ask Kiari out and she turned me down. Not because of me being autistic, but it was her way of saying it wasn't meant to be. Of course, I was disappointed and upset for a bit, but in the end, a person like her was meant to be my friend and I can live with that. She taught me to learn to love myself before I can love someone. She even said to me in one of my posts on Facebook that love will come for me as I was referring to the ending theme from the movie Splash. Even my mother told me that just because she's not the girl for me doesn't mean she and I can't still be friends. For some, it's hard to take rejection and being turned down. It can be hurtful and painful. In the end, my friendship with Kiari is a good one. It's an example of how someone you love, even if they aren't meant to date you, turns out to be a good friend to you. When it comes to dating and rejection, when being on the spectrum, it's tough. But in the end, it's all about trial and error. Never give up. The right person is out there for you and them. Someday, I know I'll find the right person in my life. For now, it's not my time to do it, and that's okay, too. Love will come for me when I least expect it. And the same goes for everyone else. The same principle applies to friendship. Sometimes it's also hard for someone on the spectrum to find friends. In the end, like with love, people will be your friend. In the end, you know who your true friends are. Thanks for watching, everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And remember, it's time for adventure. And during these trying times, please stay home, wash your hands, and when you go out, please be sure to practice social distancing and stay safe.